Well, Saints fans have now experienced two of the most stunning playoff losses in NFL history, and they've done it in back-to-back -back seasons. Of course, last year, the way it went down uh, in Minnesota with the Stephon Diggs touchdown to end the Saints season. This year, what will be remembered, obviously, is the no-call on the Tommy Lee Lewis play. Now, Sean Payton said immediately after the game in his post-game press conference that the NFL told him, admitted to him, that they blew the call, that it should have been a pass interference and maybe even a helmet-to-helmet. Look, there's nothing you can do about it now, but it was a horribly wrong call. And if you do the math on it, the reason it's so bad is the Saints would have had a first down inside the 10-yard line. The Rams would have had one time one timeout left in the game so you could kneel on it run the clock down and then Will Lutz essentially has an extra point to end the game and send you to the Super Bowl it really you would say at that point if that call is made correctly you're at at least 98 percent chance to win instead it doesn't happen the Saints get the field goal but then the Rams have plenty of time obviously uh, they get the tie and field goal. Then they get, look, they made a great defensive play to hit Drew Brees' arms. John Johnson gets the interception. They get a ridiculous 57-yard field goal to end it. The, the no call literally changed you from a win to a loss, and that is just stunning. And, look, it's stunning to me, too. I'm having a hard time getting past this. I will say one tiny bright, not tiny, one legitimate bright spot coming out of it. Drew Brees was just asked how about coming back next year. He is under contract, but obviously you can retire at any point. He, he was asked, will you be back next year? He said, I feel pretty positive. So that's a great thing. You get Drew Brees back, your core of this team. The Saints are an extremely young team. People don't quite realize that because you've got a 40-year-old quarterback. This is an extremely young team from the offensive line to Kamara and Thomas to many parts of that defense. Uh, Cam Jordan is still in his prime. And, but, but then Lattimore and Rankins and Marcus Williams and across that defense, you have got a great young core. Drew Brees comes back. No reason you can't make a number, another run. The Saints finish as a loss in the NFC Championship game. They've played in three championship games now, of course, 06, 09, and then this one. And you're one and two in championship games. That means three times in franchise history, the Saints have finished as one of the four uh, best teams in the NFL. They did that this year. An amazing season comes to an end.